Oh, there's the wood. I work. Squat this trailer a bit. Yeah, right. <laughs> So you've seen us get this unit set in here thanks to uh, medley equipment they brought one of them big bad boy forklifts out here and yanked it right out of the ground after jake dewey just couldn't come through for us yeah. <laughs> it was a good effort give appreciate it, it. Try. yep give it to old college try so the mustang md 1100 is in the ground and now we're slithery snaking wires through all yeah, the uh, you know and this is gonna suck to pull it off there but yeah you're gonna have to deal with that. Not me. What'll really suck? I don't guess it'll really suck, but break in the middle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Pull it on pull, through. Pull it when you're ready. Got the old fish tape over here. Oh. Uh, yep. Yeah. Hold that. Hold that. Oh, I was going to say, yeah, oh, there we go, there we go, all right, finally got the old Mustang MD 1100 moved in here, what's, what's all that, oh no, that's, that, that's, oh, that's, that's the Cadillac, in it. it's the Cadillac, this, oh no, I yes, that is condensation, so finally got the Mustang Dino moved in over here, as you've seen. And now it's time to get this thing set up. So we got the PC powered on finally. And then I figured out we don't need the PC. <clears throat> so turned the server on, which is what we actually use. And now Sean's about to drill into his really expensive concrete floors for some tie downs. We already got our first customer lined up too. Yeah. Yeah, that's the reason we're hurrying to do this. Yeah. We should have set up somebody to come over and dine a long time ago. Yeah. Uh, which, we're not 100% sure that everything is good because we haven't ran this out here yet. But no. You know how it goes though, try man. try it at some point, right? We just need somebody to rush us into things. Yes. Yep. Cue Shane. Yeah. Come yep. on over. Yep. That's why this morning, whenever he was like, man, I don't really need power numbers. I just need... A spot to turn, you know. Yeah, a controlled environment tires. to do a little Freeze, tuning. You know? Yeah. Freeze. No, that and that'll get us to doing what we need to do. Otherwise, I wouldn't have put these in today. Man, did you see all the comments on the uh, the video about all the people that were excited to see Shane? I hadn't um, seen him yeah. in a long time. Yeah. Ooh. All right, we really don't know how to use this thing, but let's, <laughs> let's rip home. it. What do you got here, Shane? What'd you bring us? I've uh, I've heard stories about. I've heard that this car was a bad mofo. Well, it's a totally different motor now, but it probably it probably really mess you up now. Well, back in the day, it used to be a small block on nitrous, 
So yeah, just a 350 on a on an eight and a half it inch tire, good. and yeah. I've, I've heard the story. Yeah, it ran good. Some some very uh, pronounced people got beat by it. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway. You know, we don't we don't need to talk about old oh, stuff yeah. or anything. Yeah. You know. I mean. So hey, so what is it now though? That thing hooked on an eight and a half inch tire. Yeah. I'll tell you right there. All you need to know. Yeah. I was blowing the tires off on a ten and a half inch tire. <laughs> and I was still right next to yeah. me. Hey, and we were on the narrowest. It's a good thing this car's little. Yeah. Otherwise, we'd have, we'd have traded paint for sure. <laughs> we were on a little. How, how wide do you think that road was? It's, it's old sixty six. It's old sixty six. That right there. Oh, man, that'd be cool. Very, very little road. Yeah. Concrete, man, was awesome on that road. It, it was. And this car made just enough power to not spin. Yeah. yeah. And it had a real loose converter, too. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> That's a good recipe. Yeah. So, so what is it now? So it's a 355, 6-inch rod, pro-charged, small block. I mean, I see the sticker on the, on the windshield. On the 85. Love those covers, dude. They, I know, of course, you like those. Yeah, well, <laughs> I like the gold ones better. Oh, cool, yeah, but a little D1 on it, yeah. E85, you said E85 intercooler. Me and Sean was talking about that at first. I didn't have it intercooler on it, uh -huh. and I put one on it. So it's well, it's it's mixed him, opinions, come man. To find out, man, it, it's not that big of a deal on E, yeah. Still not a I just man, I just can't make myself. Hey, numbers, I, yeah, no, the, the I don't like. It, I was they don't. skeptical about not having it. I just know I don't have any parts that will take that kind of abuse. Power uh, numbers do not lie. A billet motor with fucking coated pistons and shit, maybe. Well, I know of two combinations that are, I mean, really close to the same. Besides, yeah. one's all billet, huh, Ryan? Yeah. Uh, and then the other one, you know. It's got nice parts in it, yeah. for sure. They're yeah. both nice pieces. They both made the same amount of power. One with an intercooler, one without an intercooler. Yeah. And uh, they made the same. Same turbos, same everything, yeah. same tuner. It's 40 more cubic inches, billet. <laughs> oh, you know, whatever. Yeah. We don't need to split hairs or anything. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I think his made a little bit more power. Yeah, it fucking should. Yeah. So, no no meth injection or anything like that? No, Just straight no. E85 and intercooler, is it a... I guess air to water. He's not really concerned yeah, with any water. power poles. He, he's driven it. He's got a stumble in it, and he just wanted to instead of going and driving it around. Nice and controlled tuning, environment. He wanted a controlled yes. environment, and not to mention, you know, we got a lot of cars in front of this thing. We literally three minutes ago just got done uh, putting these anchors in the ground. <laughs> yep, yeah. no big deal. And, and, and we they have were checked with the torque wrench. Yeah, 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 they were checked. Yeah, with the torque wrench, fifty over what they're they call for. I'm sure, but it's yes. fine. I mean, if it'll take that though, yeah. right? Yeah. Like normally, they stop the torque before you break the bolt or strip out the hole that it's going in. Yeah. We didn't do any of those. Pounds over, and they're still tight. And yep. It's good to go. Yep. Nah, it ain't gonna pull them out. It ain't gonna make enough power. What? what I mean, what kind of power would something like? I know that D1. It'd probably make what five, six hundred, pretty easy. Well, when I first was putting this together, the goal was eight hundred. But Ugh. I don't. I'd be stretching it with a D1. Yeah, I mean, it'll make it, but you're going to be wringing its neck. I think it'll make seven probably pretty easy. I, I imagine it would need a smaller pulley know. than what you got there. I don't know what uh, injectors are in it either. Looks like 225 precisions. Are they 225, Shane? No. Oh, 160s? Uh, yeah, 160s or 180s. I can't remember. Yeah. 160, 180, whatever it takes. Perfect. Yeah, there you go. That one might do it. <laughs> I got it. Drivability is work. Yeah, yeah. It needs to be. Man, that's an old school it. sticker right I think, there. I think it's got a distributor on it. Yeah. It yeah. does have a distributor on it. That's just for phasing. Mm. What uh, what EFI do you have? Holly Dominator. Holly Dominator, yeah. right on. Yeah, it's uh, the one out of my race car. Oh, okay. I just didn't have, have time or the money to buy another one. Yeah. Yeah. So. That, that I asked him why he didn't put his motor and everything from the other car. He said he wanted to drive it around. I don't blame him. I don't, I don't blame, blame him either. Yeah. Which well, I have. I have another motor that's water jacket, but it has solid heads on it right now. What? Uh, what? What transmission? <laughs> Turbo three fifty. Hell yeah. Yeah. With Transco. That's what was in it back then yes. too. Transco so. 
with a full valve yeah. and full manual. <laughs> We're talking some he brought, muscle. He brought the dummy with him too. Yep. The dummy He's brought Shane with him. Yeah, yeah. Yep, everybody was asking about Bob in the Dune video. Everybody's like, where's the dummy? Uh, Shane's here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yep. He just didn't bring the mannequin. Yeah, Shane's I showed here. up. He just didn't bring Bob with him. <laughs> yeah. He's in yep. the car. Yep. Man. Man, you yeah. wasn't kidding about them headers, huh? Dude, they well, suck. they thread the needle with that Dude, steering suck. shaft. Oh. So hard. So they're a three-piece. The, the back tube and the front tube comes apart. Look at that steering shaft. And that's how you have to put it in. Oh, yeah. That's just like the ones on the uh, 55. Super comps. Yeah. And I made, I made the intake elbow. I made that. Hell yeah. I remember. What do you got Look. here? Is this that oil filter? You uh, can't get the oil filter on and off of it with the headers on. Oh yeah. yeah, that's just like the 55 was. You can't get much. Uh uh, <laughs> it's it's all in there. Yeah. Got the old cool. big red on it. Uh huh. Air filter barely fit in. Yep. Yeah. All right. You gonna rip this thing or what? Yeah. We need to roll it. I guess we yeah, need to we see if it actually yeah. reads numbers roll and stuff. Roll it, and I'm going to. And then we don't. We never even foot rolled this, Shane. Uh, I'm not gonna say rush us. Forced our hand. Forced our hand to get this thing done, which yep. is what exactly what we need. Yeah. Uh, Me and you would have kept on being like, man, we would have got it. this done today. But uh, at some point, uh, Mustang's gonna come out. They're gonna make sure everything's good. We did lose something that is very vital to this thing reading right. We did, and I still don't know how. There's a 49 point. What is it? 49.6 or it's something. It's stamped on it. I They're remember. Stamped yeah. on top of it. It's got a little handle. And it's a weight. That's probably in one of these cars around here. Yeah. And we don't know. Yeah, we used it. We used it for ballast at some point. Uh, yeah, probably cut it up. <laughs> probably, probably cut it up. Used probably. It for, you know, all different sections. Because we're stupid. Yeah. That was. It was the best door stop ever. Yeah. I just cannot believe. I have no idea. It's got to be here went. somewhere. Like I thought it was in uh, the connexes and everything with. with yeah. All this. Have we looked? It's it. It's not anywhere around anywhere there. It's it's else? not in that drawer or anything. You rolling? Yeah, I have to put my brake on. Mm -hmm. uh, so basically, we don't know if the speed sensor or anything's gonna work. So as soon as you start rolling it, I'll start uh, strapping. You look at the mile uh, per hour. If the mile per hour works, then chances are yeah. it's gonna read something.
biggest thing is everything that is nostalgic in drag racing. Uh -huh. Like with his shifter, stock steering wheel, drag light. Hey, Shane's that guy, man. He does more with less. He, love they, him, he's man. him, he's I him. Love and him. when you're out in Western Oklahoma, that's what we used to have to do also. That's all we had. Yeah, you do what you got. Well, now, of course, which I'm not gonna act like I grew up when you couldn't order things offline and ship yeah. them in, because I did, yeah. but it wasn't like it is now where you go to Google and you click a couple buttons and it shows up. So, like Shane has to make most of his stuff. That's cool, man. Hey, everything that I remember, man. I didn't say it in that hard. Yeah, it made 500. Oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know, as long as our moving our dyno and all that, we just looked at it on the graph. We didn't set anything up to have a sheet or nothing, but it, it hit 500 just now. Let me up. Okay, well, here, I'll, I'll get it set up. All right, so you got this, you got this rig, got a little bit of hail damage up there. Little, See, I mean, you got this thing. I mean, it's set outside for, you know, five or six years. Yeah, yeah no big five deal. or six. Poor car. So you got this rig iced down. Yeah, we got ice in the intercooler. And What's it gonna make? I mean, it made 500. I, man, my goal was 575. I mean, it, it'll make that. Yeah, I think anyways. It's still be easy on it. So, what's the whole thing like? Uh, like twenty six hundred, something like that. Twenty six eighty. Not bad in street trim. Yeah. With no lightning. Yeah. Yeah. You know, except a few holes in the hood. Yeah. Hey, no, I'm had, I'm had, a hole in the hood type guy, man. Had to make it fit somehow. Everything I have around here has holes in the hood. Yeah. So this is factory. That's a tilt hood yeah. like that. Yeah. Nice. You had to cut that hood up, and it just it broke my heart it's to a, cut that it's thing out. It's a 355 model, ah. too. Nope. Yeah. Look at that. That came off the stock hood right there. Same same color. Yeah, you're supposed to pin it. Is what the instructions said. And I was like, no, I'm gonna make the factory hood. Yeah. Shane's on an instruction type cat. No. Yeah, old school small block Chevy, turbo 350, and a D1 on E85. Yeah. Sound familiar? Yeah. <laughs> cheapest heads you can get from Simon. Yeah? Are they aluminum? Yeah. There you go. So did you put your own uh, injector bungs in, or did you? No, I did not do that intake. Somebody else did that intake. Yeah, it's pretty tough without... But I, I have everything to do it, so I just I haven't had time to do it. But I have another intake. You gotta get them bones straight. Yeah. That's a, that's kind of a thing. It's if pretty you, important. If you don't get them straight, it's pretty important. Yeah. I got a, I got a mill and a lathe at my house, so I, I can do it. Just, that's pretty handy there. He's telling me that he uh, milled, this still has a 7.5 rear end in it. And so even back in the day, whenever he got uh, rear ends, he'd have to, you have to shave down the, Turn the pinion down. Turn the pinion make down to make it bearing. fit because the pinion bearing was so small. So he found one out of a what a Maz Monza? Uh, Monte Carlo, the 7.5. 7 the car. Yeah. It's bigger. So now he doesn't have to machine. What did you machine down on this? The housing. I the inside bearing. I put it in my mill and I bored it out to accept the 7.5 S10 pinion bearing. So now you can just get bigger. gears for a S10 and it'll fit right in without him having to machine Man. down the pinion. You worried about sounds breaking like, the seven five? Sounds like or? a whole lot of work to put a seven five <laughs> in something. It'll break an axle before it breaks a ring opinion again. Yeah. It'll break that axle too. But it don't have trans brakes, so plus this thing weight transfer is pretty good. All yeah. it, it, I mean, it's it's probably not going to wheel hop a whole lot because it's, but it's going to put the power down. What is it? Is it leaf spring or what is it? That's a ladder bar. Oh, okay. A torque arm. Oh, to the back of the like from the factory. Yes, it's all that's. I mean, we got we got Lakewood shocks on the back. Some old fifty fifties. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Fifty fifties or ninety tens. Ninety tens on, on, on the front. We got ninety tens on the front. Yeah. <laughs> did you see earlier when he stuck it? How oh, it yeah. is? I didn't know oh, if, yeah. you, if you saw that or not. Yeah, no, it's a Dalton's cool in for a tree, didn't he? Yeah, he is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's like three or four things I still want to do to it. I want to. Put a bigger yeah. radiator in it, wider. Yeah. Uh, I need to make, make some heat shields for the master cylinder from the headers and stuff. 
and I want to put my bigger fuel cell in and an anti-roll bar. Just the top where that's how we put the water in. Sean just gave me an anti-roll bar, so yeah. maybe I can make it fit. I'll, I'll try to make it work, see if I can. And we just ordered a, a 10 soldiers for Aiden's car, and he had to have an underslung. So I'm pretty sure that's the same radiator I got in my truck. Yeah, no, hey, it's I'm a little. I'm pretty positive. I, I think yours might be a little bit smaller than that. Because it's the same one on the donk, right? Yeah, so, yes. Yes, yeah, same so one on the donk. Is it the same one? No, it's a little different. I think these are just a touch bigger. Yeah. That was one of the radiators. That they work oh, great. That's right. You had it, two like this, huh? Yeah. Yep. It's just a cheapy summit unit, is what mine is. It works amazing. I just like Same it as that one. The heat shield, and the fan, or the fan shroud, and the fans all right up close. And yep. It just works. It just does. It just does. How does it work, Shane? How's the D1 it and the Vega works? It yeah. just does. So, is there any nitrous on this rig, too, or no? No, no nitrous. No nitrous? No. Be a lot cooler if there was. We probably got a bottle in an nozzle somewhere. That rear end don't think so. <laughs> I mean, I got it. He's going, hey, man, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> shut up, man. Yeah, that's cool. This is the one that used to do all the burnout stuff in, huh? Yeah, the burnout show. Yeah, burnout I thought he was going to run over the crowd one time. And he was like, no, I had it, man. That's what he told me when he got out of the car. Every, the crowd was running. Yeah. Yeah, the well, crowd scared. was running. He's scared of You're him. supposed to stop the burnout when the burnout's done. Shane made a pass after his burnout. I mean, it can't be bursting. It's a good thing we were in Elk City, and Shane's kind of a big thing out in Elk. Yeah. You know? Like otherwise, other, oh, people yeah. would have had questions Plus for Shane's him. Shane's buddies with all the firemen that were were running that deal, and yeah. And uh, but the crowd, they thought he was coming up in into up up the curb and into the crowd. So in our comments on the Dune video where we just went out to Little Sahara, someone said uh, they know they're buddies with the cop who used to chase you around when you were street racing at home, and then come to your house. He lives up in Washington area now. Yeah, I, that's how he caught me that one time. <laughs> he just went to my mom and dad's house. Yep. <laughs> I already put the I mean, car. it's not a big enough town to, you can't really run from the cops. Yep. Like you can elude them, but you can't really run from them. No. Like if they if they see you, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of over. Yeah. Unless you make a couple turns and, and then you're gone, but yeah. then they still know who you were. Yep. I got away twice, but I got caught the third time. <laughs> Yeah, Shane Street raced way before I got into it. Yeah. Way before. He had all this stuff whenever I met him. I did not have it. Like this same car he had yeah, when you... this is the car that he had how long, have, how long have you had this car? 1998. Wow. I my senior that's year a, in high school. That's about whenever I met Almost him. 30 years. Shane was a guy around town where if you needed somebody to put a rear gear in your car or build your Turbo 350, yeah. Shane built them all. Yeah. Nice. 400s, 350s, I didn't do those. I didn't do anything else. Like, that's, that's what people would say, you know? Hey, man, you want to check out this 350, man? It chain built it. That's cool. I remember Jeremy Rogers told me one time, and, and Jeremy Rogers is, you know, his boy. Yeah, yeah. And he's yeah. like, he had that, uh, what was it, like an 86 short wide? Yeah, yeah. That blue one? And you built that 350 in that yeah, one. Yeah, we canned it, put heads on it, and we put a nitrous kit on it. Yeah, you Shane built this thing, man. I was like, dang! <laughs> <laughs> what? Was Shane, we didn't know at that point, and he was younger than me. Yeah. And he could build all this stuff. Put the rare ring of pinion in it, we put a yep. spool in it, and uh, we was putting that, him and his brother was there helping work on his truck one night, and he had to go to the parts store to get some connectors or something that we needed for the truck. Yeah. He told his brother, get in the truck, let's go take it for a ride. And we took it down the street, and we hit the nitrous on it. He comes back and he's like, why is my truck all hot? We're all giggling and laughing. Runs good on the nitrous. <laughs> he didn't even get to drive it the first time. <laughs> Wasn't really much else to do there, you know? Chicks and drugs. Yeah. And race cars. And race cars. cars. It, I mean, it's not, it's, it's, not, it's not a bad selection. No, it's not. Cool it's, it's three pretty good things. Yeah. <laughs> off-road too <laughs> see i didn't do the off-road yeah plenty of the others we rode a lot of atvs a lot of atvs i borrowed a lot of atvs yeah i did not have any of my own <laughs> and and atcs probably yeah <laughs> wade send me a cap <laughs> those things look at suck. that look at how long it's taken him to get this out man so, I mean, it took so it's taken so long that you had to turn the camera back on. Yes. Yeah. Hey, so you remember when we went down the cash days down there? And I, 
the other guy went to jail and I didn't. Allegedly. Yes. Yeah, allegedly. Remember everybody went out yeah. first round but you. Yeah. Remember that? I remember. Yeah. And then Shane won. Oh my. Sort of. <laughs> that first night, we couldn't get my gas cap off of my tank in my car. So we had to go to Smiley's the next day and we bought a brand new fuel valve, or fuel tank cap and put it in my car because we couldn't get it off that first night. Oh, them things suck. Yeah. Good. Yeah, it's good. So, that reminds me. So this is the battery box. Oh, uh, this is the little guy. It's just a little guy right here. Yep. That thing's older than you. I, yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> yeah, I believe it. Everything in this car is. Okay. Right. Look, safety oh. first with Shane though. So there's a got him a little divider right oh, here. Yeah, you know, so, yeah, he's well, got to have him a firewall. To, when I used to go to Thunder Valley all the time. The tech inspector always used to give me shit about my battery box. Yeah. Well, it's got to be separate from the driver. And the fuel tank. Shame. And the fuel tank. <laughs> so I had to make this divider to make him happy so yeah. I could make passes at the track. Yeah. And as you see, it's not in there. It's at home. This thing ain't mini tubbed or nothing. Yeah. Is this still a 26? 26, eight and a half? Yeah, it is. Oh, no, Quick Time Pro? Yeah, Quick Time Pro, so it's a it's an 1150. Yeah. I don't know why they lie to me. <laughs> yeah, Because yeah. yeah, it's actually a 950. I don't know why the Quick Time Pro's got to lie. <laughs> These tires are probably older in Dalton, too. Mm -hmm. No, those are brand new. <laughs> I also just got those. Everything work? But take it for a rip, man. Yeah. Sound like it lugged it down quite yeah. a bit more. We had I think the, the inertia. I think the brake lugged it down too much. Okay. Because we don't have all this set up, yeah, you know. Yeah, I mean, it's you, can, you don't have that special weight. Yeah. <laughs> Did everything look good though, as far as the tune-up, yeah, or? I, man, it, it added a bunch of fuel up on top, but uh, man, yeah, I it think it didn't sound as clean. I yeah. think it, I think it's rich up on top. Yeah. So, and I, I'd be fine with that right now, just making some, some yeah. pulls. I mean, it's still still freshly new yeah i mean this motor really yeah put this right here that way shane doesn't forget it put it behind his car so he's <laughs> got to move it <laughs> i'll throw it in front of his truck if he leaves without this thing yep dalton never seen bob man that's crazy how have you never seen bob i don't know he's kind of creepy it was have you met shane <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> he said bob's creepy shane he is. That's why he's in there. He, he sticks to himself. Yeah. Sorry, I was using him. That's no, okay. We got that little pulley right there. Uh huh. What is this guy? 385? 355. Wow. Yeah. How much boost does it I don't know. Do what? How much boost is that thing making? Nine and a half, ten. Oh, wow. Oh, that's it? It probably needs that little pulley, huh? Yeah. 
He ain't even working that D1 yeah, at nine he ain't pounds. Go 20 pounds. Yeah. yeah. What, is that what you made? 22, actually. Yeah. Till the belt started slipping. Yeah. In, yeah, in high gear. Like <laughs> then I made about 18. <laughs> <laughs> when are you going to take your car out? Uh, we started last night. I know. I heard it. We, uh, yeah, we ordered good. them some stuff from Wade this morning so they can finish up the cold pipe because it's all different because that compressor housing is way bigger. So. Nope. Sounded good. Sounded like it fired right up. Yeah, well, I was cranking on for a while. Yeah? And then it fired right up. But Oh, I didn't get the first video. No, right? Oh, it's <laughs> phony. Yeah, 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 it's a fake. Yeah. Fake. Then, I just need that and a fuel pump. It's ready to go. You got to get a fuel pump. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. How much for those valve covers, Shane? Like 30 cents. Huh? Dude, I've had those for like 20 years. I know, they're cool. My dad used to have a set of those hanging in his in his little office in his barn. I wish they were gold ones. Gold ones. Yeah. They're red. You see the gold ones more than you see blue, though. Blue are probably the most ones that you don't, I mean, you know, the blue. <laughs> but the red ones are cool, too, though. Yeah. They're all cool because of the anodizing. That's what Shane needs. If anybody has any red ones, send them to us. We'll put them on this car. Yeah, email us 187 customs at themurdernova.com. Let's figure it out. Yeah, let us the know, old let us know red you stamped Moroso valve covers. And I'll get these blue ones off of him. Even if we hang them on the wall. Yeah. They're cool. They are. Drag light. I don't care what anybody says, man. I like drag lights. I always have. Remember when Andrade beat locked those ones? Yep. So they got the 195 Volkswagen tire on the front. That looks like a 18575. 14. So those are for a Mustang. Yeah. These wheels are multi pattern. So oh, okay. Vega comes with a four inch four lug. Yeah. So I took the rotors to a machine shop and they cut, they turned them and then cut the holes for the four and a quarter or whatever the Mustang wheels are. Same with the axles, did the same with the axles. So it, it's actually a Ford Mustang pattern. We just increased the bolt pattern. So, cause no one made wheels for these cars. Yeah. So that's the only thing I can do. Yeah, it's got the factory brakes. Yeah. 77 Vegas brakes. Oh yeah. Stops great. Stop. A little speed hole down there. Uh huh. That's lightweight. That's, you should come out there with exhaust. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought it was at first. Upon closer inspection, I realized it was not. My dad used to have a uh, Vega panel wagon that he raced. Four speed. Remember back in the day, whenever people had wheels like this, and they were the multi patterns, and people had plugs. The, in the red ones plugs or blue the, plug yeah. or whatever. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yep. Anytime I ever got one of these wheel, any of these wheels, I took the center caps and threw them away. Not Shane. He rocks them. I, I, I've never run a rear center cap on anything. Whenever we sell Bogart wheels. I have to ask people if they want them or not, because I, I never do. Most everybody does, though. Yeah. I pulled the plug, looked at it, but I've been running on it, starting it, and it looked like crap. So I put one new plug in, and we'll make a pull, and I leaned it out just a little bit. So, let's see, we never got a text back. We asked yeah, some yeah. Uh, E85. See if, it it. see if it likes it. Just lean it out until it's not happy. Yeah, so <laughs> lean it out a little yep. bit, We'll make another pool and see what happens. We better rip this and, wheel? Oh, and I erased the rev limiter too. Perfect. So that, that's why I fell on the face. All at once. Yeah. That's why I fell on his face up there.
lot cleaner. That's a lot better. We're gonna make 18 more pools after this one. Okay. Don't say this is the last one. Yeah. Last one is where everything bad happens. Yes. Yeah. Just like Brian. Just whatever you do, one, one more. Ride. One. You can't say one more. We're gonna make three more. Yeah. We'll see how this one does. Yeah. Then maybe make a couple more. I mean, <laughs> creeping up on it. <laughs> With weather correction, man, it would have it would have went over. So close, so close. I mean, I mean it's not bad for nah. ten pounds, nine pounds, whatever. Yeah. We'll, uh, check the plug, see what it looks like. Go from there. But, uh, I did that a lot at that time. So yeah. I can look at the data. I'm sure the yeah. memory card was in there, and yeah, it's a hollow. <laughs> no memory card. No. Oh, it goes to the laptop. Perfect. We just gotta remember the number that uh, we saved it to on the laptop. So the last three numbers were 610. So I can go to the data log. 610. Pretty cool. Yeah. Pretty cool. At least we know it's everything still rolls. We can fine tune everything. What are you looking at? That trim ring is black. This one is chrome. I think this one used to be chrome and the it's or it used off. to be black. You can see the chrome here. It just wore off. Look at it. So I had I used to have these in my dragon mm -hmm. Took them out and put it in my dragon Well, you know, the crash happened. Yeah. <laughs> That's not really a, yeah. a situation. <laughs> so that one got destroyed. I mean, it depends on who you're talking to. <laughs> I found that one on eBay. Oh, that's the only okay. Thing I so found. it's a different set. Yes. Uh, it's it's for the later gear or earlier gear. So anyway, I need to find a problem so I can put back in. So. There you go, guys. <laughs> if anybody it's in has the, it's, it's a seventy-seven got a, Vega. It's got yep. a black eye. It's been punched yep. in that. Yeah. Yep. Got old black eye over there. So everything still rolls, it still reads numbers. We need to fine tune it and figure everything out on it, but at least it works. Yes. So we can go from there. Made, let's just call it 500. It made 500. Made 500. Weather, our weather station isn't on yet. We don't really know how to turn it on, so we'll have to get the station on that. But first dyno session in the books. One of 
one of many to come. So uh, you guys know the drill. If you haven't already, go ahead and click that subscribe button, share the channel, comment, everything helps. Um, you can go to www.themurdernova.com. We got lots of new merch in there for y'all to check out. And uh, that's gonna do it for this video, guys. So we'll see you on the next one.